What is up? It's Mickey here, and this is the part three of the tank game and scratch that we did last time. And this is also day three of the daily upload for a week, and it's going pretty smooth so far, so I hope it stays like that. Today we're going to be modifying the bullet a bit and also adding a blue tank and a blue bullet. So uh, first thing, I want to change the bullet costume, so zoom in all the way. And um, we're going to clear it, and we're going to go to... Um, Pencil, smallest size there is, and then simply make a circle. It's pretty easy. Um, if you zoom in all the way, it becomes a lot easier. But you can see what I'm doing, and it works pretty well. So um, we want to change that to the darkest red we can find, and that looks good. It's more like a maroon. Oops. <laughs> uh, you want to paint in that, and then go to the second darkest uh, red and put that in okay or actually let's do the all right I think that looks good so then hopefully it looks a little bit better oh it's way too big so we're gonna go to 200 and then uh, it still looks a little bit too big so we're gonna make it 150 but uh, I think this is a little bit we can make it like 160, 75. But the problem is you can see it like through right here. So what we're gonna do to fix that is all we're gonna do is say move, let's do um, 20, let's say 20 steps. And let's see how that looks. That looks, that looks perfect and that's what we want. Okay, so this is the part where, let's say real quick, this is the part where we're going to be adding a blue tank and a blue bullet. So in order to duplicate a object, all you have to do is right click it and press duplicate. And then um, same thing for the bullet and we're going to press duplicate. So in the red tank, we're going to go into our costumes, zoom in all the way. And I provided this art in the description so you guys can look at that for the part one if you want it. But all I'm going to do is take the, uh, let's see, yeah, okay, let's take the darkest blue and then our turquoise and let's take the lightest turquoise and then the second third and then fourth oh whoops wrong color but put that okay and then in here um basically the same thing as you may guess so go into this color and then go to the darkest one and put in the outline whoops I always do that. It's annoying. <laughs> so we put that in, and it looks good. Um, so then for the uh, red bullet, it's going to be WASD and F to shoot. So if key F is pressed, which is right here, then go to red tank, and then make this instead of right, we actually want to use D. And then instead of left, you want to use A. If you want to up, you should press W. I can find that and then down would be s and that's really all it takes to make the basic um, basic two tanks it's gonna get annoying in the future though because um, you need oh whoops oh right we need to create all the variables so before I discuss what I was about to say let's make a um, blue move speed and then blue reload time and then blue move speed oh blue turn speed sorry blue turn speed and um and then instead of doing this we're just going to make that red turn speed no we want blue turn speed here we want blue move speed and then instead of this you can just right click it and put blue moves uh blue turn speed here we put blue turn speed once again, and then here we can put blue move speed and blue uh, blue move speed, which is right here. And if you guys didn't know, this is a new thing that they add on in Scratch, but all you have to do is right click the variable, and you don't even need to drag in the new one. You can just right click it and then replace it with something. So if I wanted to make this red reload time for some reason, I could do that, but obviously I want it to be blue move speed. And then go into let's hide all of these 
go into bullet uh go into the bullet and then um obviously you want to make that blue reload time and then make that blue reload time and go to blue tank uh oh uh red tank too which we're going to rename to blue tank and then um uh what was i gonna do okay yeah we need to go back into the bullet and then say direction of blue tank actually and that's it for the bullets so you can see that with f i don't have two players to play this with but you can see that use m and then we can use f f and m they both shoot the collision doesn't work yet but what i was saying before is it's going to be hard since we have two things two tanks if we want to add like power-ups and stuff we're going to have to add them to both so that kind of sucks but we need to have two tanks in order to do that um but obviously uh we just added a blue tank and a blue bullet and it was pretty quick we want to rename this to blue bullet and yeah so um we can play this one last time and you can see that blue works and then red works and then you can like shoot here and then you can press f here and yeah so i think that's going to be it for this episode i hope you guys enjoyed if you have any suggestions for the next part which is probably going to be tomorrow let me know in the comments below um i'll see you guys next time and peace out